Are you still searching for that perfect at-home salon experience? Non-drippy formula, great, great, great grey coverage. Why can't I say that? And value for money? Then look no further. I have a special treat for you. Hello guys. I've just got back from the gym. Actually, no, I have not just got back from the gym. I've been back from the gym for quite a few hours and been doing some housework and some garden work. Oh, you should see my nails. They look so gross as does the rest of me. Um, does anyone else do that? Like when you get back from the gym, you just keep working away because you're like, oh, I'm already sweaty, so I'm going to get more sweaty. So I may as well just not shower until hours go by. <laughs> anyway, I have something very exciting to show you. Um, this beautiful brand, Morocco, uh, they reached out to me to say, ask whether I wanted to try some of their at-home hair dye kits. Now have a look, well you probably already noticed, but look at the state of my hair guys. What What is this? That, that's like two months worth of growth there. Plus, oh my god, you should see, I'm getting on in age and my grey hair has just grown exponentially in the last few years. Anyway, back to the matter at hand. They asked whether I wanted to try out their hair dye, and of course, yes, I would love to try out their at-home kits. I was not expecting this at all. So, in this kit, let me show you what you get. This handy dandy little roll. This is your cup to mix your dye in. Then in this roll, you also get, look how beautifully made it is. It's all like gorgeously sewn. It's got these little pockets and it's got your hair clips, a spoolie. There's something else in that pocket. I'll have to have a look in a second. You've got the developer, a brush. It says yours to keep. So sweet. A new cape. Hopefully this one doesn't look like a bin bag, like, <laughs> like the one that I currently have. I think she was about... Three dollars, maybe? You could quite as easily just put a hole in a bin bag. This is what this thing feels like. No wonder it was <laughs> And then um, the actual hair dye. Now I chose brown number six. Tip number one, if you're an amateur or a beginner um, dyeing your hair at home, don't wear clothing like this because when you dye your hair and you need to take your clothes off, this is going to get all dye and things on it, um, unless you want to get dye on your clothes. I always wear a shirt. I'll be back in a second. This is my beautiful hair dyeing shirt. <clears throat> As you can see here, many hair dyes done in this shirt. I always do a long sleeve one too, even though it's a bit hot. Although it's cooling down on the coast now, thankfully. We've had the longest summer ever middle of March and it's boiling still. <laughs> All right, I am prepared. Oof, I'm actually a bit warm in this thing. Okay, I'm just going to brush my hair first so it makes it a little bit easier to actually section it out. Okay, I gotta take this shirt off. I'm sweating too much, it's too hot. Well, these are the nicest feeling gloves I've ever worn. <laughs> they absolutely crap all over those disgusting plastic ones that you get in the um, in the box dye kits. Oh my god, that's better. I'm oh, so hot right then. Okay, I've got my gloves on. I've got my cape on, and my hair is lovely and brushed. How's the volume? <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna section it. Crown of my head to my ear. Oh, I need to turn the air con on. It's so hot. I'm boiling right now. Ugh. Woo! I need a moment. I gotta go lay on the fan under the fan. Okay, we're ready. Let's do it. I usually start at the back. Maybe I should. Mm, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll just do it the way that I usually do it. Hey. I need my core clip, my favourite clip. I've had this old beast for so long. She's lost an arm now. 
probably need to get a new one. Do you know what I will say? It's such a lovely thick paste that it's really like, it's not real drippy and stuff. You know how sometimes when you get box dyes, like the developer and stuff is so drippy and just gets everywhere. I feel like I'm going to be very neat with this and it won't go everywhere. <laughs> Fingers crossed, hey? So it's a full last bit. I always leave like these parts of hair around my ears and around the nape of my neck um, until the last because I find if I do it like while I'm sectioning that part, um, I just, I get dye all over my ear um, or ears and the nape of my neck. I mean, so most of the time I do get dye kind of on those sections anyway. Um, but look, this kind of lessens it a little bit. And I also leave to do like my hairline oh. to the very end. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why, just cause. <laughs> I don't have a better uh, answer than that. Cause I'm very precise with my words. <laughs> that was actually the perfect ratio. I followed um, the directions for um, for grey coverage and it was 50 grams of colour to 50 grams of um, developer. Don't do what I did and place the scales on the beautiful little roll thing that it comes in because my scales when I was putting the colour in weren't actually being accurate so I kind of eyeballed that um, and did about half a tube. There's another benefit to um, this kit is that it, it will give you two lots of coverage. It's quite generous really. So I'm going to leave it on for 20 minutes. No, not 20, 30 minutes. Um, and then wash it. And then, oh, actually they did give me another thing. I'll just grab it. This is a new product of theirs. Pure Miracle Powder. Oh, actually, what? And simply pull the powder into your into your colour mixture for mid length and ends of your hair and apply colour as per usual. Oh, okay, so if you were colouring um, the rest of your hair rather than just the roots like I did, um, you can pop it actually in your hair dye. Or, using the Morocco bowl and brush, mix the entire contents of the sachet with four to five pumps of your regular conditioner. It should turn into a slight clay consistency. Shampoo your hair twice, lightly towel dry your hair and apply the mix to damp hair. Comb the treatment through thoroughly, wait 15 minutes and then rinse out completely. Oh, ultimate booster treatment. Actually, I'll use that at another time. That's cool. That's really good actually. All right, so then I'm going to just, so I'm going to wait 30 minutes. And I'm going to wash my hair. I'm going to do Two, I'm going to do two shampoos and condition, and then I'll style uh, like I usually do, and I'll come back. Completely silent. Yeah, I'll be completely silent. So this is the results. What do you think? I'm so happy, especially because the before was such, in such bad shape. <laughs> that now I feel a little bit more put together. Actually, just then my daughter came up and she was like, wow, mum, you look really nice. And she goes, not that you don't look nice all the time, but you look just that, like extra bit nice. <laughs> but the hair color, I'm really, really happy with it. It felt so good to wash it out. It was really thick and you can tell that it was like good quality. Um, good quality product. So I am super stoked. My hair is still obviously um, a little bit damp. Us Keller girls like to diffuse it, not to the absolute bone dry. So Morocco has actually kindly offered you guys a discount if you want to purchase your own at home professional hair coloring kit. Um, so if you put in the code Kendra20, you'll get a 20% discount. 
I will leave the links to their website and also their Instagram handle in the description box below for you to check out but please do I'm so stoked and I'm absolutely blown away by the results and I have another lot to use again so you get two for the price of the one that's amazing value they are fully Australian owned um, they are a fully female owned as well small business all their products are vegan and cruelty free another nifty thing is on their website you can go on there and do a hair color uh, quiz so that you can get the right uh, color that you want for yourself um, all their products are really user friendly as well like I'll show you um, so in the kit it came with a little set of instructions very very simple easy and straight to the point um, and additionally they have this little bit code on the back so that you it, it'll direct you to uh, their YouTube videos and how-to guides on there they also have those videos on their website so so if you're ever stuck like you can just go straight there as well I'm so happy I'm so happy to be brown again <laughs> and do yourself a favor and have a look at Morocco go follow them on Instagram as well <laughs> do all the YouTube things like comment down below and tell me what you want to see next I'm sorry that it has been such a long time between videos do you know what actually I want to get into vlogging what do you think of that I'm thinking about like doing a weekly vlog where I just like take my phone because I just um, camera I just video on my phone and just um, take you around what we do what I do in a day either on a weekend probably on a weekend because weekdays are a bit boring they just get up go to the gym go to work come home go to bed <laughs> um, but weekends are a little bit more eventful I guess probably still boring but but do you know what? That's what's holding me back is that I feel like my videos are going to be boring so I'll get negative feedback and then I just don't do it anyway to begin with. And it's silly. It's a silly mindset to be in. Anyway, love you guys. Bye. Check out my beautiful dress. Isn't it gorgeous? I feel like a little prancy ballerina in it. It's so floaty and gorgeous. You won't be able to find it because it's from the op shop where the majority of my wardrobe is from. Actually, is that what you'd want, what you guys might want to see? Do you want to see my wardrobe? And because I desperately need to clean it out. Bye. Non drippy formula, great, great coverage There's and some value for money. Weight on your shoulders. <laughs> The sparkle walk right out of your eyes Some seasons a life might get colder